even though a TV production schedule may be lightning fast, show writers, directors, and visual artists take time to pay attention to the details. So when the chance to slip in a hidden reference presents itself, they take it. Casual viewers may not catch the references hidden in a TV show, but diehard fans will be rewarded with a nod to another one of their favorite shows or to the punchline of a long-running joke. Make sure you let us know about other cool Easter eggs we might have missed in the comments below. Here are Screen Rant's 10 hidden references in amazing TV series. The Walking Dead, Red Challenge. In one of the lighter scenes from The Walking Dead's first season, Glenn drives a red Dodge Challenger out of Atlanta, blasting music and the car's alarm to draw away walkers from other members of his group. A red Dodge Challenger also appears on another AMC series, Breaking Bad. Walter White buys the car for his son, and the general manager of the dealership just so happens to be a man named Glenn. The appearance of the car is just one of tons of Easter eggs that have led some fans to believe that the two shows exist in the same universe. The Flash, creator credits. In its very first episode, the CW's Flash was jam-packed with Easter eggs and nods to the Speedsters comic book history. The show also tipped its hat directly to the writers who had made the biggest impact on the character. Writer Mark Wade, illustrator Scott Collins, and artist Howard Porter all contributed memorable work to the Flash comics, included as street addresses in the show's universe. Hello. Code 237 on Wade Boulevard. But none of that compares to Professor Stein's Conway Prize for Scientific Achievement, named for famous Marvel and DC writer Jerry Conway. The Conway Prize for Scientific Advancement. The creator of Stein's alter ego, Firestorm. Fringe. Fox's Observer. Fox's sci-fi series Fringe followed a team of FBI agents who use fringe science to investigate unexplained events, all under the watchful eye of a mysterious bald stranger called The Observer. The Observer appears in every episode of Fringe, but leading up to the show's second season, this mysterious man appeared on other Fox broadcasts. He could be seen in the audience on American Idol, on the sidelines of a football game and a NASCAR race, and in the crowd at a Major League Baseball game. Easter eggs in one show are impressive, but across a network, that's really rare. The Walking Dead. Kirkman's works. Before The Walking Dead was a hit TV show, it was a hit comic series by Robert Kirkman. It wasn't Kirkman's only comic either. References to the creator's other comics are littered throughout the show's five seasons. Carl's shirt from season one features the logo of Science Dog, another Kirkman comic. And in season five, copies of The Astounding Wolfman and Invincible make appearances on screen being read by Carl and Enid. Community. Beetlejuice. Tim Burton's 1988 comedy horror film Beetlejuice stars a freelance bioexorcist who helps ghouls scare away the humans who move into their homes. If you need his services, Beetlejuice can be summoned by simply saying his name three times. Beetlejuice? Yes, that's it! Community set up a three season long gag based on that idea. After working Beetlejuice's name into scripts in seasons one and two, Bitter Butter Beetlejuice? Beetlejuice. The ghoulish character appears in the third season when Annie finally speaks his name for the third and final time. Beetlejuice soundtrack and NPR podcast. Gotham, Queen Consolidated. The CW's Arrow follows the vigilante Oliver Queen, heir to mega corporation Queen Consolidated. Fellow DC Comics TV show Gotham takes place in an alternate universe, but the two cross paths when a Queen Consolidated logo appears in the skyline of Gotham's famous city. Gotham producer Danny Cannon denied this was an indication of a crossover between the two series, claiming the logo's inclusion was unintentional. The Walking Dead, Macon, Georgia. Following the success of the AMC series, Telltale Games developed an episodic adventure series based in the zombie-infested world. Instead of following Rick Grimes, the game focuses on characters Lee Everett and Clementine in the Georgia town of Macon. The game received critical acclaim and even earned its own reference in the TV show. In the season 4 premiere, Michonne points out the county of Macon on a map, an easily missed nod to the video game. Battlestar Galactica Serenity Lives. The short-lived space western Firefly has earned a massive die-hard fan base, who helped the show live on in the feature film Serenity, named after the spaceship piloted in the series. Shortly after Firefly ended, the Battlestar Galactica miniseries premiered, one more cult sci-fi series with a dedicated following. The premiere paid homage to its colleague, including a brief shot of Serenity in the show's background. The shot was included by visual effects artist Jared Davis and Lee Stringer, who both worked on Firefly as well as the big screen adaptation. Community Stock Photos For a few years, NBC's Thursday night comedy block was a heavy hitter, including 30 Rock, Community, and Parks and Recreation. When Troy is reacting to meeting his childhood idol in season 2, a poster on the wall features a stock photo of another NBC comedy star. The candy striper on the poster is none other than Park and Rec's Amy Poehler, who was in her 20s when she posed for the photos well before she played Leslie Nope. Star Trek Voyager Presidential Crew 
The political drama The West Wing offered audiences a look inside of the workings of Washington's White House, and apparently earned plenty of fans in the art department on Star Trek Voyage. So when a Season 7 episode saw Seven of Nine pull up a list of crew members killed in action on the Starship Voyager, names like Commander Jay Bartlett were obvious references to West Wing cast members, like Martin Sheen's President Jed Bartlett. Star Trek graphic arts supervisor Mike Okuda confirmed the nod to the political drama, and said that he wasn't the only staffer looking to give the TV show a nod. So what do you think of our list? Did we miss any of your favorite references or Easter eggs in popular TV series? Let us know in our comment section and don't forget to subscribe to our channel to watch more Screen Rant videos like this one.